Hi, I'm Till. In this video, I'd like to show you the smooth integration between iTero Element and ExoCAD software in a chair side environment. We'll start with the case setup. We'll set up a case not for a real patient, but for this plastic demonstration model, which needs a crown on the first upper molar. We choose a ceramic material. Then we make sure that the case type is correctly set to chair side milling and we type in the patient name. Now we proceed to the scanning. As an iTero user, you're certainly familiar with the scanning process. So I'll skip right to the end. Okay, the scanning is done and I'll hit the send button, confirm and after a short while the files will all be transferred to the other PC and the notification will be visible. I now click on the view in DentalDB button and as you can see, the case is automatically imported with the selected material and the selected indication. The software will now automatically load the scan data and will proceed with the margin line detection. I quickly confirm the insertion axis, looks fine to me, so let's proceed. Now the software will analyze the scan data and detect the adjacent teeth and come up with an automatic placement suggestion for a tooth. I could adjust this manually, but it looks fine to me, so let's just proceed to the simulation of the patient's jaw movement for dynamic occlusion. The tooth will now be adjusted both to the margin, but also to the adjacents and the antagonist. Once again, I could make some modifications during the free forming manually, but here I'll just skip to the next step, and which is the blank placement. I here choose a Vita Trilux blank, so that you can also see uh, the nice visualization of the multi-shaded blank. Let's have a look. Again, I can adjust the suggested blank placement to have full control over the shading. This case is now ready for production. Thank you for watching this video. For further information about ExoCAD products or how to purchase, please contact your ExoCAD reseller.